worth playing for us? We've got the night crew with us. Hey! Oh. <laughs> Not very good. <laughs> they found us. <laughs> Well, yell, 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 yell. Now then, I have know these guys from Lanky Cats, and that's about it, really. And um, so uh, I want you to go around. I've got four bodies besides myself in here, and I want to go around now in a, a kind of a circle, and I want you to kind of introduce yourselves. Right. I'm John. I play lead guitar. Have you got a second name, John? Elliot. John Elliot, and he plays lead guitar. Next. Dave Cotton, drums. Dave Cotton on drums. I'm the fabulous Mark Knight. I'm lead singer and rhythm guitarist. Are you only fabulous, Mark? Are you? Oh, yeah. That's all you are. Fabulous. Oh, right. I thought you were brilliant, magic and fabulous. All, all of that. But that oh, this is yeah. the only word that could come out. And right. I'm Jim Remington, play bass. And you, Jimmy? Remington. Jimmy Remington plays bass. John, Jimmy, Dave. And Mark. And Mark. And so. Welcome to... Lanky Beat Live, that's uh, thank what you. Thank, thank you. you do yeah, for everybody. Thank you. Thank you. So uh, we're, we're interested, I've got loads of listeners gagging to hear uh, what you're all about, you guys. So, um, have you brought a CD with you? I did, yes, I brought one with me. Yeah. Well, can you bring it through, please? I and, can, yeah. yeah please, I'll, and we'll I'll get just it lined up for later. Shovel past the cans of beans and, and uh, <laughs> bags of potatoes around yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. We'll start off with you, Dave. I right, think, yeah. Because your you're case. the newest member of the I band. I am indeed. The yeah. oldest and the newest. Yeah. <laughs> uh, tell me your little story about what happened, you know, leading up to you leaving your old band and coming into this new band. Well, I've had a bad year with my son passing away. Right. And I thought yeah. it was time with the other band. I, I took it as far as I wanted to go. Yeah, yeah. And what band was it called? What the Monkey it? Men. The Monkey Men, was yeah. it? Yeah. Right. Yeah, and we'd had a good time. Everything was okay. The lads are still fine. And we're still good friends. Great. Um, I hung up my boots for a fortnight. <laughs> <laughs> that's about the length. Yeah, that's yeah. about the length then, of time. Uh, yeah. And then through Lanky Cats. And through other people. Bill Holmes and one yeah. or two others. Oh, yeah. I'm back on track. Yeah. I'm enjoying it. Absolutely love it. And I mean, did, did you just kind of ring these guys up and said, hey, do you want a drummer? More or less. More or less. <laughs> <laughs> they said, yeah, but not you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you had an excellent <clears throat> drummer. Uh, in your band. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Artie. Yeah. Artie, uh, Artie what? Artie Davis. Davis. Yeah. And, uh, <clears throat> I mean, Artie's a legend as a drummer in Liverpool, isn't he? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. Uh, he's been around the block a few times and, and done it all. Yeah. Ten times over, hasn't he? And yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. It, you, it, it you were very it. lucky to have such a talented Ex drummer in your band, especially so. Yeah. 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 How, how long was he with you? Uh, about four years. Four years. Yes. Good four yeah. years. Yeah. yeah. Going on well, five. Very, very well. Yeah. He lasted longer than the Beatles did, really. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that that's it. So Dave, you're you're, you're enjoying it. With uh, yeah, these I love guys. it. Love it. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me, Mark, what um, what kind of um, influence has Dave had on the band since he joined? A major influence. Has actually. he? Yeah, yeah. Um, like, yeah. You all want to leave now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's all yeah, all yeah, yeah. 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 He sort of brings a different different dimension. Yeah. Um, and he sort of lifted us, hasn't it? Mm. Sort of thing. Mm. That's, that's, that's the best way to put it. Yeah, really. that's a yeah. great compliment, that. Yeah. 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 No, no, seriously, in all seriousness, mm. yeah. yeah. Uh, if he's lifting you, in other words, he's not just lifting you, he's driving you. Yes. And that's what a drummer's job is, yes. mm. to drive. Absolutely. And a lot of drummers don't do it. No. You know, they do mm. not do it. No. Uh, but Dave, I noticed when you played down at Lanky Cats, I thought, I've got to be interested in this. Yeah. And I've noticed um, he's gone up a level. Yeah. And it's set you guys up a level. Yeah, well, we can, mm. yeah. he said to me, he, he, he did say to me, well, Rachel, if I, if I do too much, just let me know. I said, don't worry, you, you, but <clears throat> bring, what, bring your flair. That, he's I a like modest that. guy, you yeah. see. Mm. And... I, I have, you know, we have that dilemma, don't we? Yeah, of course. <coughs> putting too much in or not enough in yeah. and getting that balance, that's, isn't it? That's it. That's and it and putting the right stuff at the right yeah. time. And you, you, you agonise over it, don't you? Mm. Um, how much to actually do and not to do. Yeah. Now, some some bands I've played with, oh, get it done, get it, get it. And others, we don't want anything, just do it straight, you know. Yeah. So, but I, there's a balance in yeah, there. Yeah, so, there is. Isn't there? There is, yeah. 
Yeah. So with you, Mark, I mean, um, lead singer, the big job is up front. The main is instrument <laughs> is vocals. Yeah. yeah. And uh, and you've got it in spades. I mean, uh, Thank you. the way you have your blonde quiff. And, uh, <laughs> I was going to say, I'll be on the way quiff, all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah I'll, again, I'll describe him. He's got his leather waistcoat on and his open neck shirt. And his, uh, it's a, a kind of a, what we call it, a mauve shirt, yes. isn't it? And, yes. uh, and very, very uh, in to get uh, on very together pair of pants and uh, try you know, to be yeah yeah and uh he's looking very very suave and indeed and uh looking very happy praise right. indeed oh, i am very happy and we'll we'll go across now we'll go back now to john, john. and uh your lead guitarist yes, yes. And i noticed you brought your guitar tonight are you going to be doing something for us well, this is we bought two acoustics. They belong to Excellent. Mark, but um, they both belong are you, to Mark. Are you going to you're going to play yeah, some sure, live? Yeah, yeah, fantastic. That's it, great. It yeah, we'll do that later. Yeah. 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 And uh, and uh, who, who was founding member of the band? Who was founding member? Um, well, yeah, John and another guy originally um, auditioned me. Yeah. And then the other guy went his own way, and then John and I decided we would carry it on. Right, right. Yeah, so. and, and how long have you been together, kind of, uh, you know, as a unit like you are? Since 2011. 2011. That's not bad going, is it? Crew been together. Not bad yeah. going. Yeah, but uh, as we are now, I would say you came along when? 2000, Jim. I've been about four years. So it's 2013, yeah, yeah. as we are now. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. yeah. So, um, so have you enjoyed yourself with this band? Yeah, definitely. And they're very sad to hear you leaving, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I tell him every week. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's what they told me. Well, yeah, you know, yeah. you get these good opportunities that come up and you just can't turn them down, can you? <laughs> it takes a lot to make a, a, a group of young men gel so well and become not just a band, but a, a bunch of blokes who work for each other. Mm. Mm. And sometimes it happens on stage and sometimes it doesn't. It's happening with you guys. All the yeah. time. Yeah. All yeah. the time. Yeah. All, whatever's gone on before the stage, once we're on the stage, it's different. Yeah. Mm. We, we know what each other's going to do. You, you know, if you go in a slightly different direction, which happens, yeah. they'll follow you. Yeah. And that's what you want. That's right. That's You've right. got to know your lads. And you're, re and you're relying on each other. Yeah. Camaraderie. Yeah. You know and uh, working for each other. You know. I think the thing with this band, and it's always been from day one, everybody just really enjoys it. Yeah. We just thoroughly enjoy what we're doing. Yeah. It's a social thing as much as anything else when we have a rehearsal. I'm glad you said that. It's a social it? night yeah. out for us. Mm -hmm. yeah. And we just, we just enjoy it. This is what we do. I mean, yeah. people, people say to me, oh, do you never go out drinking? No. Well, what do you do when you go out? I go out to a gig, play with bands. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's yeah. what we, that's what we do. Yeah, yeah, it's um, yeah, it's amazing what you've got. Right? Uh, yeah, you know. we take yeah. our girls with us, don't we? And yeah, they support us. And of course, lest we forget, he's on this guy's t-shirt. Oh yes, yes. yes. Don't forget them. Yeah, soldiers. And of course, yeah. I've forgotten Ladies. their name already, haven't I? Jim. <laughs> Jim. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Jim. No worries. Um, lest we forget that excellent, excellent mm. t-shirt that you've got there. With the red poppy, yeah, uh, yeah, the black t-shirt, yeah. Lest we forget, and uh, looking very dapper in his <laughs> um, his nice, uh, nicely washed and pressed jeans. Yeah, thanks to my missus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Pam. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Is that Pam? Yeah, she's was, my partner. Was she yeah. billeting? Do you think? That's, she's going to try and tune in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. right, yeah. right. That's a great. Say, yeah. and say hello to Pam. Right. Okay. What I'm going to do is play a track now mm -hmm. from. And let people listen to what you actually sound like. Have you any particular preference of these tracks? Uh, no, what I've done, I've put uh, six tracks on from the album Move It that we had previously. Yeah. And then there's another four tracks of stuff that we're working on or have just introduced. Yeah. So uh, perhaps better putting Move It on as we always open with Move It on. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, okay, we'll do just that. And uh, I think we're all set for that. Yeah. Let's give it a whirl, see what happens. No, I didn't think that was right. So let's have a look what we've got here. Let's have a look. Uh, uh, I I think uh, we put it in here and it's registering no disc. So we've not we have a problem I think here. So uh, anyway, meanwhile we'll carry on chatting between each other. Uh, I'd like to know, uh, 
uh, from you, Dave. Yeah. What um, what got you going in the business all those donkeys years ago? It's, it's something from being little. I always wanted a drum kit. Right. I always wanted, and I started off just with a, a snare drum and a cymbal. Yeah. And then it went from that. How old um, were you? How old were you when you were doing this? Fourteen. 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 Yeah. <laughs> a long time ago. I know. I and know. then at sixteen, when I was working, I burnt my hands with acid, right. and it took the skin off both hands. What were you doing playing with acid? I was working in a garage, and yeah. I was in charge at sixteen of the shop that dealt with the car batteries, really, and and, and wagon batteries. It was a big setup. Yeah. And I got nasty acid burns, and I was off work for about three months. I had a motorbike, hung the forge to run it, sold the bike, bought a drum kit. Did you? Yeah. 20, did 25 you know, quid. Did you know month. whether 25 quid? Yeah. I know. Right. Ridiculous yeah. days, weren't they? Yeah. When you think about it. And then from then, moved up to another one at 60 pounds. Yeah. And then you just go on and on and you on. You do, you do, yeah. Yeah, yeah it's a, that's a nice little story. What, what about you, uh, John? How did you get into the business? How did I get into I've always been into the music. I got into the like, like when you were at school, I mean. What? Very early age I got into the music. Yeah. I was like eight years old. Yeah. When rock and roll first exploded, if you like, yeah. in yeah. this country. Uh, and the first person that I heard was Tommy Steele. Yeah, Little White Bull. <laughs> well, it wasn't <laughs> Little White Bull, but probably singing the blues. Yeah. Oh, right, there. right. And, and it was like, wow, what is this? You what know? is it? Because you, nobody had heard music like this before. Never. It was all crooners like Sinatra and it big was. band singers. Yeah, black and white minstrels. Black show. and white yeah. minstrels. We can't and sell that now, can we? Suddenly you have this. <laughs> Not PC anymore, <laughs> things like that, is it? And then, of course, I, I got really into the Tommy Steele thing and then Elvis, obviously, yeah. Yeah. Um, when I was like nine years old. And other people my age weren't into the music. And when I was 16 and people of my age were getting into the Beatles and yeah. Liverpool yeah. groups, yeah. I, I just didn't like it. I, I wanted all the stuff that came before. Did you? Yeah. You're a true rocker then, aren't you? <laughs> a true rocker. You had to leave your rock and roll roots to find the Beatles. And for them, that uh, mods, mods, yeah. I think we could... We, we had the mods and rockers, Mods didn't and we? rockers. Yeah. And yeah. you definitely had to, you know, you, you had a, a big decision to make. Yeah. You couldn't have your quiff like uh, Mark has. You couldn't have anything like that. You wanted to move on to the likes of the Beatles. That's well, right. Like yeah. 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 Two different cultures. Exactly, yeah. And uh, there's not much been said or written about that kind of uh, cultural differences that we have in it. And it, mm. what it was reflected in the music. Yes. If you like, the, for instance, if you either like the Beatles or the Stones, mm. I, could, I, could, I could honestly say that, yeah. can't mm. I? Yeah. yeah. And uh, you're either one type of guy and gal, or another type of guy and gal, and uh, and th there was a line you were divided. You were yeah, definitely True. divided. And even even prior to that, you were either Cliff or Elvis. Ah, that's that. Nice yeah. one. Yeah, <coughs> yeah. That's what you were. You, you were. Know. Yeah. You yeah. you weren't into both of them. That's <laughs> one or the other. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Jim, what about you and your influences? Mine in was the same at school. When I was forty years of age. It was all the rock and roll years. Um, like you say, you, if it was raining, you used to go into the hall and we all used to bring our records and play them on the record player in the hall. Right. And that infl influenced me to uh, start thinking about taking up the guitar. So you got, you got going in school time, really? School time, yeah. 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 And you play great any time, any dinner times, so it was raining. Right. You bring your records in. Yeah. And you, you play them in the hall, and all the kids used to be driving around at 14 years of age. How oh, enlightened was that? I mean, I got, I, when I went to school, um, I'd never heard anything like that. Like, yeah, you know, while we were an hour and a half for dinner. Yeah. No. I'll <laughs> put your records on. It was a hell of a long time like, like that for, yeah. for lunch yeah. and yeah. dinner. But what a good idea that yeah, is playing all the records yeah. and getting into yeah. it in that. It's all the rock and roll way. stuff which mm. I liked. Yeah, yeah. Any, thought, anybody in particular? It's similar to what they call it, Mark. Uh, yeah. to John. It was um Tommy Steele, as Demiris, Marty Wilde and yeah. all people like that. And you're still leaning towards the rock and roll side of things. Yeah. Yeah. And that reflects in the band, doesn't it? It does, mm. it does, yeah. Well, well, the first track you've given me to play 
is an old stager of a record. And I think this is the one that did it for me. It moved right. me into something. I have no idea what it was, but it did something. Listen to this. Ah, we've not got that one. That's the one. it that's what um it was all about when was that 1958 Eight. Yeah. 1958 yeah. I am, I, yeah you have to have a good memory yeah, yeah. yeah. 1958 <laughs> but when something happens to you like that um that moves you so much uh in 1958 i uh would be 11 years old i was 10 mm. yeah yeah i was just an idea <laughs> yeah, I know. He, he's he's boasting again, how young he is. Yeah. Isn't he? <laughs> I, I, what's it like playing with these old fellas, Mark? Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Can't beat like, experience. Yeah. As long as the else is on and off stage and into yeah. the crowd, <laughs> I'm fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. Well, tell me what, what have you got lined up? Uh, it, we're coming to the festive season, as they oh, say. Yes. Yes, what have you got lined up? Bands? Quite quite busy actually. Excellent. Um, we're in Buxton Working Men's Club on the first. Which is that? That's Buxton. 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 Yes, this, yes, it's his, it's his accent. I know. <laughs> my, yes, it's, it's your accent and my hearing, and we don't go together <laughs> yeah, anywhere. Yeah. I'm afraid. Yeah, Buxton. Buxton. Nice yeah. Um, yeah. Hey, yeah. Before you go into that, where you playing? Where are you from originally? I know, Dave. You're Preston. Yeah. Yeah. London. John? Yeah, London, yeah. right. Which area of London? You always said London. Near Ealing. Eh? Ealing. Ealing. Yeah, I don't Which know. Which is in Essex. No, right. it? West London. Yeah, yeah. That's in Essex. Yeah. Nowhere near. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Mark? Ac Accrington. Accrington. And I'm a Salford boy. I'm a Salford boy. What, um, how come you all got together in this particular way when you saw, you know, uh, geographically? So? Yeah, well, I was auditioned. Where was I auditioned? Somewhere near you. Yeah. Yeah. Some, somewhere near there, man. I drove out because I had the time. And yeah. Yeah, because I've lived, I've lived in Bury now for the yeah. last 40 years. Yeah. So, yeah. It, that's just how I met these two. So. Yeah. You're not, you're not lost your accent, have you? Have I not? No. We're not. Well, <laughs> it has a bit of a Northern Cockney, you've got, I think. Right. Northern Cockney. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> me, me and John was in the band, weren't we, before? Yeah. But oh. it didn't work out, did it? That's right, yeah. And then he phoned me up one day, he's, uh, he's got the yeah. band together, would you like to join? Jumps at the chance, yeah. Fantastic, yeah. fantastic. Yeah. yeah. So, um, I'm going to play a little bit more music, and if you let me know what uh, track you would like me to play now. Well, I've already picked one, so I think you should pick one. Right, okay, John, have a look at that. Right, what so, what right we got? So. <laughs> <laughs> Um, go for I can tell. No, it's only make believe. Really? Yeah. It's only make believe. Yeah. Okay. He does a good job on this. On yeah. Stage, doesn't he, he? he don't do a bad job. Does yeah. He? Yeah. <laughs> now then, could be better. You've written these on on, on, on the back of a fag packet. Yeah. <laughs> um, no, there not, is the tenor. Not numbered them, and I have to count down now. <laughs> yeah. One, two, three, four, six. five. Track six is that okay. now. So I load that into the. Uh, Get thing in me bubble here, it pops up, and I, if I do this, Mr. and that's not what we wanted, no. is it? <laughs> what did Mr. Moonlight come from? Let's try that again. No, no, we're not having that. We're not having it. What about this? That one. That's it. What about this? No, 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 no. See, this is what happens when you uh, when you're labouring with this particular equipment. We uh, we we do very well, I think. Um, <laughs> I only learned how to do all this about Christmas last year, and I do it every two weeks, which of course is not often enough. And uh, I, I come along and then make all sorts of a mess of it. So it anyway, uh, it's only make believe by the Night Crew. That's the night crew and Mark Knight singing full on then. Wunny, full on night. Nice tune. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. 
That you, again you, you typifies. Play you, you again. You nothing without the band. Yeah, but no, no. It's um, you. You need the, the voice carries <coughs> the band. I'm afraid to say, boys. Yeah. All the hard so, work that you're doing on stage. The voice is what they're all listening to. Oh yeah, we yeah. have to get used to that. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. We all have to get used yeah. to it. So you know, and <laughs> you have to let the man just take it away. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it, man. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I've, it's not just got a uh, a good singing voice, Mark. You've got a good stage presence. Does that mean anything to you? Um. Yeah, I like being centre of attention, I'll be honest. I yeah, know. Yeah. Or I did grow up as a child, you know. Um, yeah. I like to perform, I like to entertain, I like yeah, people yeah. enjoying what... It, it, it's obvious, obvious yeah. you know, when you, you see it. Now then, you play guitar as well, don't you? You're not just like... Um... Well, if that's what you want to call it. Um, <laughs> I, 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 I took over rhythm guitar, I, I was quite inexperienced myself. Yeah. Although I've had a guitar all my life, I never played basic. Right. Basic three or four chip Well, it, it all looks excellent to me. Uh, uh, whether it sounds... Yeah. Any good? Is it, is it any good? His guitar. It's good. It's yeah, good. Yeah. I yeah. thought he was. Yeah. He's he's making out he's not any good. <laughs> well, no, no. I, I, I've always said I, I get by. Yeah. Uh, and I do admit I've listened to some recordings over the past two years and I've improved a whole, a whole lot. Yeah. Uh, I was yeah. I was stuck in that position where I had to do it. So. Yeah, you could, mm. you've improved a hell of a lot as well. Yeah, yeah. I thought you were going to say that. Yeah. I was being yeah. polite. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> and if anybody's offended by saying hell, well, you know, yeah. uh, you know, that's just what we're all about, yeah. unfortunately. Yeah. But uh, no, we, we apologise if there is anybody offended by that. But uh, because we're we're talking to uh, uh, the night crew here uh, from Wrightington Hospital Radio Studio, and. Um, it's all for you, you listeners, in, uh, you know, tucked up in your bed. You should be nice and snug, you know, ruffle your pillows up, you know, and uh, get yourself tucked up and up the neck and, you know, and get yourself nice and relaxed because we've got about, around about 10 minutes left of these guys and then we're afraid we'll have to say goodbye. Oh. But, uh, you know, you have to start winding down pretty early. Mm -hmm. um, you know, 10 minutes is, is nothing in this business yeah. to start winding down. So um, now then, what we've got to do is, again, play a little bit more music for you. And he turns and looks at what he's got to look on his dial here. And he'll, uh, and he'll press this button and away we go. And nothing happens as usual. So, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, Turn up your radio and tune in that dial. Bill Hart on your radio, you know he's guaranteed to make a smile. Oh. Hospital Radio, the best sound around. Across the wards of Wrightington and Wigan hospitals, playing the best of yesterday, this is Wrightington Hospital Radio. This is Bill Hart. You're listening to the Lanky Beat Live show, and uh, it's a great pleasure to have in company here the night crew. And we've, uh, they, 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 you know, they told me they were stood outside, they didn't want to disturb me while I was broadcasting. <laughs> And uh, they, you know, I think we they came in. Uh, I expected them around about eight o'clock, and they came in about twenty past. So yeah. it's, it's short and sweet, unfortunately. Right. And uh, but there's always another time, isn't there? So we'll look forward to try and do that. Meanwhile, uh, here's another track from the Night Crew. And if I could get one going, it would be great. No, we're not having that one again. No, no. See. See what happens? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> it was on six like that there, it's like that. And then it's come up on number ten. It's come up on ten. So that's, that's we're having fun here, yeah. We're having some good fun here. It's come up on ten again. Now I wonder what's going on. Yeah. That wants to play then. Yeah, it wants to play that. So I'll try number three. No, it's not it's not doing as we asked. It to do and uh, what a shame what a shame what a shame it's come up track 10 now if we could try and get track 10 playing yeah. it'd be great but it's not coming up 
you know, it's not coming up. No, we have that one again. No. Anyway, we're, uh, we're, we're getting towards the end of the show. We can't have that particular last track. Um, I think there's something slightly amiss about the, um, uh, the CD itself, maybe not been recorded. But uh, anyway, let's have a listen again. Yeah, that's the nice one, the number six. We've just heard that one. Let's uh, try another one. Let's have a look at what we got. What we got? got try, try another one. Cry, cry, cry. Try, cry, cry. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we'll try oh seven. Oh seven. Come on, boy. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh seven. Oh seven. Yes, and that's given us that. And this is oh seven. One cry, 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 cry to me once more. It must be aiming very badly. One cry, 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 now I'm going to be down the door. So let me love you. All you do is make me do. Now cry, cry, cry. You can tell them. Cry, cry, cry by the night crew. Very, very, very sweet sounding rock and roll there. Don't, don't, don't. Now, I did mention before, and I had rudely interrupted myself when I asked about the kind of forthcoming gigs. That's what's happening in the festive season. So, um, what have you got lined up? And you said Buxton. Buxton, yeah, we're quite busy. <clears throat> I think we've got about six in December, or seven actually. Yeah. Seven, seven gigs coming up in December. Mm. Um, We've got a Boxing Day one in Wigan. a club in Wigan. Well, which club's that? St Thomas's. St Thomas's Club, yeah. Yeah. I know it well. We're in... Um, oh, in Elton Falls? No. We're in the Great Rocks Club in Buxton on New Year's Eve. Right. Um, we're at the Empire in Rochdale on the 20th. Mm. There's, there's another and, one that I can't yeah, think can't, of as well. <laughs> Remember the book. Accrington on the Accrington, yeah. Yeah. Accrington. yeah. Um, my recent band experience goes back about well, back about you know, 
ooh, it must be about 10 or 12 years. Uh, but I remember uh, never having seven gigs, even though we wanted them. <laughs> we could never get seven gigs um, in a month. We always had to settle for maybe just one a weekend and maybe one extra. Five was about the maximum we could all actually right. muster. And there it were the healthy days of the social clubs. Yeah. Yes. The yeah. yes. Yeah. yes. I would say there's not these days are not the healthy days. No. And yet you're booking the trend, you guys, mm. aren't you? Well, hopefully. Yeah, hopefully. you are. <laughs> you are. I mean, tw 12 years on, there's yeah. less clubs yeah. Yeah. around. Yeah. And yet just you're turning things around. Yeah, yeah it's just a matter of um, doing your research, doing your own work and finding these places and then do, doing a good performance on the night to get rebooked. Yeah. That's, that's right. Idea. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, but we do a good performance. Yeah. we just enjoy it. And do you work through uh, a theatrical agent or, or anything like that, or do you We're just not a theatrical agent? We're mm. entertainment agencies. Yeah, uh, but we don't really. But we t tend to get our own work, to be honest. Uh, you, you get your own. So yeah. Yeah. all these in December are our own. Yeah, You're, so there's some there's some hard <clears throat> foot slogging there, yeah. isn't there? Yeah, yeah. Knocking on doors, finding the right person. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Getting hold of him. Pulling up against the wall and say, "Give us a book in." <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and of course it's getting rebooked. I yeah. mean, yeah, I know it's. Uh, <clears throat> and, and, and when you get on that roll of rebooked, 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 it then becomes dead easy, doesn't it? Yeah, uh, mm. yeah. But, it takes um, lots of pressure off. Yeah, that's right. That's yeah. right. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're coming, ladies and gentlemen, up to the last minute or two that we've got left right. here. I can only thank you most graciously. For coming on my thank you, thank you, thank you. Coming on to the Lanky yeah. Beat live show for yeah. us. It's uh, it's been a real pleasure getting to know you all a bit better. Yeah. Although I know Dave, yeah. Yeah. Dave yeah, I'll tell you a little. <laughs> I'll tell you a little bit about Dave. He looks after me caravan. If you've ah, got, that's why. Yeah, yeah, if you've got a caravan, yeah, he's your man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah we look after it. Thanks very much, Dave, no, for doing sorry. that. And uh, so, uh, <clears> so. So, John, goodbye. 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 Thank you. Goodbye, Dart, David. All right, mate. Goodbye, Mark. Cheers, Bill. And goodbye, Jim. Cheers, Bill. Thank you very much. It's been Thank a real you. pleasure. Thank Bye. you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's all there is for um, us tonight. Tuck yourselves in. Get yourself settled down. Get yourself a cup of Orlix if you can. And... Uh, have a very good night's sleep and no doubt tomorrow is just another day. Good night everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night.